pressure's real. The stakes are high. They bet big. They win big. They lose big. High stakes live action poker. Live at the bike. All right. Let's get back to the action here. Folks. As my, my boy Brandon Ool likes to say. Folks. Jack raised it up to 100. Got a couple calls. Matt Jack, still active. Yeah, it looks like he's going to run into the Aaron buzzsaw here. I told you that Matt Jack C bets 100% of the time. I was not lying. Jack, Matt. Aaron doesn't like this board, but he ain't going nowhere. This is the lockdown board that we were talking about earlier. At this point in time, Jack needs to understand abort mission. Oh, but he's not aborting mission. It's just like he might get a lay down here, but when a guy flats you on a board like that, they either have a hand that they want to see to the river, so you're setting yourself up for a massive three barrel, or they have a hand that they're slow playing you, and the hands that they want to see to the river, the only ones that they're going to fold are these two pair type hands. They're going to find a reason to call you with a set. They're always going to call you with a small flush. Uh, if uh, It's just really tough being as aggressive, as sort of blindly aggressive as Jack is. That said, we haven't seen Aaron be it's not like he's bluffing into Canuck let's say that the bluff into Canuck was just insane because Canuck, Canuck has heart he's sharp uh, I'm not saying that Aaron doesn't have heart and he isn't sharp but we have seen him play very passively tonight and so I'm more likely to think that he can jam on Aaron than he could on Canuck but even then ugh, ugh. Yeah. Now 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 it's like uh, are you going to put in $1000 on the river? Let's see. Uh Jack Matt has a lot of heart. He has a lot of heart. Uh this is actually not a bad river to bluff to tell you the truth because the guy isn't calling you down with the ace of hearts here. He probably would make a move on the flop with it. And other smaller hearts, he would have folded on the turn. This is not a bad card to three barrel on. And, you know, I think he's going to get away with it. But just even starting this thing was a bad idea. Starting the three barrel was a bad idea. If he doesn't get away with this, I'll be exceptionally surprised. It, uh, it, I, I think that Jack, Matt Jack, is smart enough to know that this was a very good card for him to bluff. But having to get yourself in this position is just horrible. Horrible. Let's look for some live tells here. Not getting any. When you're getting the massage, it's hard to give off live tells. Plus, Jack doesn't look stressed, and he's not stressed. <laughs> He does this crap all day long. He's just got more balls than what's good for him. But, you know. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Table talk. Table talk. Yeah, he's letting it go. Oh! Rubs it in his face! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! He just flops it out and rubs it in his face. So brutal. Oh, so brutal. Oh, that is a bush league, but I love it. I, oh, look at it. He's like, oh, poor, poor Aaron.